uh, we talked to a, a bunch of guys mm-hmm. who are trying to start libertarian civilizations outside of America's borders. Oh. Um, they're called seasteaders, and they're, they're using the laws of the sea, essentially. Their idea is to plant, essentially, a new uh, civilization out into the borders of the ocean, like off into international waters, <clears throat> and then okay. run it. Uh, with the principles there, I think their belief is libertarianism, but you can really run them in any way. I was asking them, like, can you run a communist uh, boat out there? And they're like, well, it's not really a boat, but yeah, you could, in theory, test these f- forms of government uh, by going out and doing these things uh, in the middle of the ocean. They were talking about how cruise ships do this, where cruise ships take advantage of the best laws from different countries. They dock themselves in one country. They hire their employees in another one. They register in another one. Because they can get this kind of like haphazard put together real country of good values through these different uh, by going through, uh, you know, all these taking the best of everybody's laws. And uh, this is kind of the concept that they're working on. And they're talking about doing it within the next 10 years. Wow. Uh, And they have some serious funding behind it, like billionaire types behind it who believe in that we can have uh, a sort of the, uh, you know, experiments on you know democracy and and living together in different ways right in the middle of the ocean uh rather than doing it here because you don't have to deal with the federal laws they were talking about how glenn's idea of independence texas where you'd have the society that you know work together in different ways but you still got to deal with the federal government they are saying you go off into international waters you don't have to do that pretty interesting stuff yeah it is yeah huh so they just live on a ship then it's kind of like I mean the I think the initial version of it would be probably like a giant cruise liner or a or a you know it could be an oil barge or you could do whatever but eventually they're talking about it. you would almost have in a way like mobile homes out there where you could join up with a another grouping of people if you like their laws and if they pissed you off you just leave and go to another grouping and you could just take your, like a boat and move your entire residence uh, and participate in whichever one you thought was the best. I mean, you want to talk about a way for the free market to uh, thrive, at least in theory, it, it could happen. And they're actually, it's not like one of these things where like, oh, we got an idea. They have a lot of funding behind it. Uh, so it's a pretty interesting interview. They just eat fish? Or no, do they come get, into the mainland? Yeah, they come into the mainland. I mean, they import oh, wow. all the stuff. Like the, their idea is essentially to work with governments, not to to have good mm-hmm. relationships with the with the nearby countries. It's mm-hmm. just that they wouldn't have to deal with those laws. And of course, that's what mm-hmm. happens. I mean, that's the booze cruise idea, and it's mm-hmm. very basic. You go into the international waters, you can kind of do a lot of stuff that you couldn't do back home. Yeah, and uh, that's that's the idea. Pretty interesting.